Hey, welcome to VoltSafe Winner. My name is Tash from the design team here at VoltSafe. By the end of this video, you should learn how to successfully connect your VoltSafe Winner plug to your app. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is go to your app store on your phone and in the search bar, type up VoltSafe Winter and download the first app. Once you have it downloaded, open the app and you should go to your control center and enable your Wi-Fi and Bluetooth permissions before you proceed. So once you have that done, you can get, click get started. Now you'll be prompted to create your account. So just enter your username, enter your email, and enter your password and confirm it too. Once your account has been created, you're gonna get a verification link sent to your email. So once you have that received, just click that link and return back to the app. So once we're back in the app, all you need to do is click next on the welcome screen and you will be prompted to check out some of the permission access details. Uh, you can just click accept and move to the next part. If for any reason uh, you have not enabled your Bluetooth or Wi-Fi at this point, you will be prompted to do so. Before proceeding, make sure you disconnect your active and passive side. Now click next. Once the VoltSafe Winner device has been recognized by the app, it will connect via Bluetooth. Then once we proceed, you'll be prompted to select your Wi-Fi network. Once you've given the app a moment to connect to your VoltSafe Winner device, it'll prompt you to select your Wi-Fi network. Please note that only 2.4 gigahertz networks are compatible with the VoltSafe Winner. Once a connection has been established, you will be prompted to connect your passive and active sites together. But please make sure that the active site is connected to a wall outlet of 120 volts AC. Now the last step for onboarding is simply name your device. Give it a simple name that identifies it from the others. And here you can see the user safety overview. Give that a quick read and click done. Now to set a schedule for your VoltSafe winner, all you gotta do is press the schedule button on the card and now you'll be at the scheduling screen. There are two ways to input the start time and the stop time for your schedule. The first way we're gonna go over is using the circle slider in the center of the screen. All you need to do is click the buttons on the blue slider and position them into your desired positions for the start and the stop time. Please note that the interface on the dial for the circle slider represents a 24 hour clock. So please keep that in mind. The second way to input your start and stop time are the two time on and time off input windows at the top of the screen. Please make sure to also include rather AM or PM for your start and stop time. Once you've inputted your start and stop time, you'll have an option to make these as recurring schedules throughout the week. So below the circle slider, you'll notice seven bubbles that range from Sunday to Saturday. Simply highlight your selected days of the week and this schedule will repeat on those days. Once you're satisfied with your inputs for the schedule, just press save. Now that you're back on the device's screen, you'll see your recently created schedule on the list. To edit an existing schedule on your VoltSafe Winter, all you need to do is expand the accordion on your device card, select the desired schedule from the list, and from here, you can simply adjust um, the circle slider or from the inputs on the top of the screen. And of course, you can change the days of the week as well. Simply click save and the changes should be applied. If you wanna delete an existing schedule, all you need to do is click on the schedule and once you're on the scheduling screen, on the top right side of the screen, you'll see a button that says delete. Click that button and the schedule should be deleted. If you wanna share the ability to turn your VoltSafe Winter on and off and set schedules with somebody else, click the gear icon and you'll be on the device settings page. Go down the list of items and find the row that says invite user, click on that row. Now go to the email field and type in the invite recipient's email and click send. 
If you're on the receiving end of an invite, please refer to the onboarding section of this video for a step-by-step -step on how to create your VoltSafe account and get your first device on your home screen. If you're having any trouble setting up your VoltSafe Winter, or you have further questions, please reach out and we'll do the best we can to help you.